okay welcome back uh, here's an update uh, I just got my blower motor box done just not too long ago uh, this is what I'll be running inside my house to pull the air through the box I just used a, just a 1 by 12 just cut it out made a box I got me a little vent up here in the top of course my motor is mounted from the inside out because I had a little there's a little wire right here and it's got I had to drill a separate hole for it but I couldn't find one that had the wires on the outside of the motor so I just had to go with an old blower motor that had come out of a old blazer STM blazer that we used to have it works real well I gotta put the squirrel cage on it yet I took it off because this piece here it's it's just like this on the inside of the box I don't know if you can see it there or not but uh, it's just got a little lip right here on the inside it's kind of sticks down below I'm going to, have to trim that off because I'm afraid it's going to restrict a little bit of airflow coming out of this box but I'm going to go ahead and get this thing hooked up to a battery just to get it tested out here's one of the batteries I'm going to be using to hook it up to because right there I don't know if you can see it real well is a 45 watt solar kit I've got five of these kits back there I'm eventually going to get them hooked up to my house but one of these is going to run this motor so I won't have to use no electricity and here's the batteries that I have bought you can get these at Walmart they're for 85 bucks it's, it's uh, the model of it's a, a max it's a ever start max marine battery is a deep cycle battery 24 volt it's uh, the part number on it's a max 29 it's a 875 cranking amps it's a 675 cold cranking amps and it is a 125 amp hour battery but uh, and yeah it's a marine deep cycle battery like I said they get them at Walmart they're 85 bucks fairly cheap from anywhere else but uh, I'm gonna have this hooked up to my solar panels and I'm going to be running my motor off this during the day charge this battery up hopefully if I can get another solar panel hooked up I can take this battery and reserve it for my power I'm going to be putting into my house and I won't have to use a battery but that will come a little bit later but uh, I'm going to get this blade put back on here and I finally got my little resistor here and also some parts that I took out of the old blazer that we used to have but I, there's a little resistor right there I just went and just bought one for it but uh, I've already got it just pre-wired just to test it out but I did use the there's the plug but this is the original this is the switch that actually came out of the blazer it's got four speeds but I took one off so I can have an off and I've got a, a low setting and I got a medium setting then I got the high setting but I took the low the lowest speed off of it so when I turn it all the way to low it actually turns the motor off when I don't want it running but uh like I said I'll get this blade put back on there and I'll just get this thing just pre-wired to have it tested out to, and I'll see how well this thing works thank you